So check this thing out. We have a six inch diameter slitting saw that's just under an eighth of an inch thick. We're gonna use this tool to create an undercut in both ends of our part inside of our counterboard. Actually don't sound too bad. Now for those of you that have used sledding saws before, this thing's constructed a little bit different from what I'm used to. So we don't have very much clearance between the tool and the counterboard itself. We don't have any screws holding our inserts in. Each insert is just held in by this little Italy shaped piece of metal here. Now that said, I'm not super comfortable with this tool just because I'm not used to my inserts just kind of floating out there in space. So what do you guys think based on the sound? You think I ought to triple the feed rate on the second side? We're also gonna try something a little new tool path wise and we're gonna go in with a dynamic spiral to cut this undercut. We're gonna leave five thou on the walls and then we're gonna come in and just do a finish pass. second side of our part I decided to just double our feed rate instead of tripling it and as machinists that's something that we do when we're unfamiliar with a tool we start off slow and then push it beyond what we think it's capable of but not so far that we end up destroying the tool If you guys like today's video, please like and subscribe. Check out our online academy and store, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.